as we've learned over the last nine months, that relationships are what children are needing. We have to help the children and teachers and parents adjust to the trauma of what COVID and this pandemic has brought into our lives. So staying connected, having things stay about the children, about what their needs are, the social emotional components of learning have become really, really important. Spectrum is unique in that it has found a way in processes and structures of the school to remain flexible and responsive to the needs of the learners in front of them. There is no set curriculum. It changes from year to year based on themes. It changes even from week to week based on the curiosity and interests and responses of the children. Spectrum's flexibility and responsiveness make it really unique. It's not tied to any specific program. It's not tied to any specific model. What it is, is it's responsive to who the teachers are and who the students are and who the families are in the here and now, in this moment of learning. More than anything, I want other educators to see you don't have to take shortcuts. You don't have to have anxiety over academic gaps created by this pandemic. What your students, what your children need more than anything is to feel connected to you, cared about from you, relating to you and relating to each other in ways that help them make decisions, be creative, ask questions, and be really a part of something, taking ownership of their learning, be excited about learning, and be experiencing the joy of learning. We know that some key strategies that we'd like to share at the conference involve how we plan with intentionality, how we really understand who our children are in that planning process, how we keep the engagement going, and how we make sure that children are able to take ownership and be part of the learning no matter where they happen to be. Our process folio and how we've begun to digitize those and digitize the work so they become an archive of student learning, both that children are helping develop and share their reflections and present to their peers, their other teachers, to their families and parents. And the other way is with really using online tools with intentionality. We want to keep learning personal and personalized. In a lot of ways that gets interpreted as using data to ex determine exactly the skill set that children need. Well, they need more than just data-driven skills instruction. Children need to be connecting with each other and with teachers on the skills they're learning. So the question that we address is, how do you keep engaged, authentic student learning going no matter where that learning is happening and how that learning is happening. How do you routinize the progress monitoring and assessment of creativity and imagination and thinking and problem solving in a way that is about the child and about the learner? We know that the most important thing we can do is recognize that learning is social learning is connected. Children need to feel primary and important and part of something. They need to feel loved. We believe that this is the unique thing we're doing at Spectrum. We really are cultivating imagination, cultivating joy in learning, making school someplace children want to be and want to be part of day in and day out.